Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel. And uh, if we take a quick look at what was in the updates yesterday, so Patch Tuesday was upon us, and that means that yesterday we had the uh, security updates for the month of May 2020, May 12th. Today, we're looking at some of the vulnerabilities in the supported versions of Windows 10. So if we look at the uh, vulnerabilities, there were in Windows 8.1, 30 flaws, as you see here, two rated critical and 28 rated important. Um, then there was in the version 1809, 75 vulnerabilities, five critical, 70 important, um, 78 vulnerabilities in 1903, five critical, 73 important. 1909 being pretty much the same version has the same number of vulnerabilities that had uh, this version of um, of Windows. So a lot of fixes, 78 flaws fixed in here, uh, which is pretty crazy. And a lot of them, and you know, five are uh, rated at critical. That means that, um, you know, of all the components that are critical and important to fix, uh, you know, in Internet Explorer 11, Microsoft Edge, uh, had some critical flaws. So uh, this is very important to check out because uh, that's a lot of stuff. And if you are <clears throat> on the uh, May 2020 update and the slow ring, well, you had an update that also gave an update to uh, fix the security flaws. So, you know, with the number of vulnerabilities, 78 in uh, 1903 and 1909, which is the bulk of Windows 10 user right now, uh, both of them together is like 80% of users. So that means that we um, we have a lot of security flaws that are fixed in the version of Windows uh, 10. So um, very important to update your system to make sure that you stay safe because there's a lot of security flaws in here as we see here in the uh, different uh, security problems that are in Windows. So once again, just uh, check it out. Mine, uh, like I said, mine was longer than usual. So uh, if you find that it's a little long to install, let it do whatever it has to do. It, it, it took longer than usual on my machine. Also, I had um, what might have made it longer. Also, I've had several driver updates that actually appeared at the same time. But uh, overall, it's uh, very important to make sure that you stay secure. And uh, if any problems arise, anything that is unusual, we'll be talking about it uh, for sure. Once again, these are the only updates for Windows 10 this month, as the Windows updates for bug fixes are not going to happen this month. Microsoft is taking a pause. And no, that does not affect the release of Windows 10 May 2020 update on uh, May 28th. So uh, just... Uh, to uh, let you know, because a lot of people think that when I said no Windows updates left for the month, it means that um, May 2020 update is not updated. No, it will be there at the end of the month. But there won't be any bug fixes that we see usually in the versions of Windows 10 like we do usually. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.